Is that really Liam Payne in our studio? This is the real Liam Payne. <laughs> Welcome to the TJ Show. Thank you for having me. Now, is doing your own thing harder than you expected? Are you pleasantly it's surprised? I, I I am surprised by what we've we've come out with. I'm I'm really really happy with with, with the record we've made, but it is a different experience for sure. Right? I mean, writing is like it's like therapy. <laughs> So you enjoy it's it. It's like soul searching. Yeah, yeah, I enjoy it. You come out and you go, ah. Oh. Why aren't you happy that you can write? There are some people who can't write. Um, yeah, I, I'm, I am happy, but I'll, I'll be honest with you, I, sh I struggled a little bit on this record because it's hard to go, okay, one, what do I think of myself? And two, what do people think of me? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Engaging those things, but then also not being too bothered about what people think about you and doing your own thing. Those are the things that you have to gauge. So that was what was difficult about, about if I'm being honest about this. So like, and I'm not precious about writing either. Like if, I, if, if I'd if i have had like a total flat line and it just wasn't happening, I'd, you know, I said, everybody else write the record, dude, let's just get people, people, you know, there are great writers in the world. Yeah, of course. There are some great, great writers in the world. So, uh, and there's a reason we have them. Yep, absolutely. Because, like you say, some people can't write. That's right. Liam, since we only have you for a little bit of time, whenever we have a celebrity guest in, we ask them an assortment of random questions, and they make very little sense. Are you ready for this? I'm, I'm born ready. This sounds like my kind of game. <laughs> yeah, okay. If you found a talking squirrel living in your attic, would you tell anyone, or would you let him be your special little secret? I think I'd have to keep him secret, because we could be friends, and we, we could both be nuts together. <laughs> Lauren? If you could have a sleepover at one celebrity's house, who would it be? Ooh. Um, there's a, there's a, uh, <laughs> this is really weird. There's a British comedian called um, Mickey Flanagan. Okay. And it would be him because he is the funniest man ever. Nice. Would you consider yourself adorable? Um, <laughs> I'd rather be considered sexy. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, I have a theory that hot people have it easier in life. Do you feel that life is easier because you're hot? <laughs> well, I mean, when I'm warm, I think things run quicker. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Okay. Uh, we know you love Toy Story, so if you had to smash Woody or Buzz Lightyear with a hammer, which one would you choose? Um, I would choose uh, ooh, um, Woody because I think he, I don't think he'd break. That's yeah. a great answer. I don't think he'd yes. break, uh, whereas hoping. Buzz Lightyear would probably smash hardcore. Yeah. Oh, I mean, it depends how, how, how hard shit and where we're coming from. Like, where's the velocity of this? Is this like a hateful, like, I hate you? Like really a Really angry day. Very, yeah. very yeah. hard hit. Okay. okay. I, I'm still, I'm sticking with Woody. I, I think he'd stay together. Okay. That's answered like a true Toy Story fan. Yeah. yeah you really exactly. thought about that. I like that answer. I had to get into it. And finally, can I have $5? You can't, if you have, uh, what are dollars? I'm joking. Five dollars. Do <laughs> <laughs> I, actually, I don't have a dollar on me. You don't, you don't carry cash? <laughs> I don't have any money. I, if I, I, I wish I had cash on me now. That'd be so funny if I did. Cause like, <laughs> I, I'd get you back so bad right now, but I don't have any money on me, no. You know, do you ever carry cash? Um, no. My, 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 missus, my missus is a firm believer in carrying, carrying um, cash. She makes us, we have a little drawer at home where we keep money. If you need to go shopping, you just like, oh, yeah. go to the money drawer. The That's money nice. drawer. Don't it's say fine. that too loud. People are going to try to find that drawer. Yeah, so then wait a people, minute. People have found it. It's oh. gone. <laughs> <laughs> now, how, how do you pay for something? If you're walking through the streets and you're like, oh, I want to buy that. How do you pay for it? Uh, a card. There's these things they have now where you can like walk past <laughs> and just go. So, you, don't even, you don't even have to press any button. You don't even have to look anyway. You can just. But you carry that in your pocket. You don't have someone carry it for you? <laughs> I said I don't have it on me. <laughs> And you know what the worst thing is? I don't know where it is. I, I had, we had this chat last night. I was sat in the car and I was thinking, should I get, um, should I get my cards cancelled again? Nah, it'll turn up somewhere. <laughs> so it's probably in a pair of jeans in my case somewhere. Else. It must be. So you just say, I uh, want that and somehow you get it. Somehow it happens, yeah. Awesome. I, like I wanted a Red Bull just now and it just appeared. It's amazing. It's amazing. It's, it's good I, to I be I wanted Liam. a squirrel in my attic and it was just there one day when I got up. I was like, wow. It's good to be Liam Payne. Liam, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. All the best this with is your fun. new single. Strip that down. We're so excited for you. Thank you. Thank you.